In this video, I take you to the Isle of Skye with me, do some painting, do some prep for my Kickstarter, launching my art books, and just tell you what's been going on for the last month or so. Hope you enjoy. I'm going on an adventure. <laughs> In mid-October, I was feeling very restless and overwhelmed with a huge amount of projects that were all happening at the same time. And I had missed my yearly visit to Skye, and so I decided to jump into the car and go for 24 hours. It was absolutely magical and perfect. My main goal was of course to be inspired and capture lots of photos and videos that I'll be able to use throughout the winter as inspiration. But beyond that, I decided to bring the proof prints of my art books so that I could take some promo photos and try to work on a bit of the promo video and I didn't really know what I was doing. I was just taking tons of little clips of anything I could think of and just trying to capture it in this beautiful place that has inspired a lot of my artwork. Even though I was absolutely exhausted from driving and sleeping in my car and doing all of the promo photos and videos, I knew I couldn't leave this place without at least one sketch. If you want to see more photos and videos from this amazing trip, you can head on over to Sarah in Scotland, my other YouTube channel. I posted a full vlog of my adventures here, 24 hours on sky. It was one of those magical trips that will truly stay with me forever.
my gosh. I'm freezing my buns off here. The wind has really picked up and it is chilly. It is time. Oh, before I freeze. Okay. During September and October, I've been really busy working on my art books, and I'm sure you've seen by now that the Kickstarter is already live. Although I did successfully self-publish a children's book using Kickstarter a few years ago, this process was way more complicated. Not only in the design, but also just digging through my archives to find the work that I felt best represents me and my path and also talking about my process and going in depth about my business and sharing a lot of behind the scenes stories. And yeah, it was just a lot. So there were just so many long days and nights spent at the computer. And honestly, I think this is a big reason I've felt on the verge of burnout. Even though I can handle a big workload, I can't handle being at my computer for most of the day just doesn't suit me. <laughs> um, so I've just really struggled to find a good balance of being productive and getting this type of work done, but also staying sane, basically. <laughs> I've had a few people ask me how I do this, how to make art books, and so I thought I would make a separate video about the process and go into more specifics about the design and the supplier and all of that stuff but I was just really happy to meet my goal of launching at the end of October and it'll be a month long Kickstarter. So there's plenty of time to order if you want to, or you can wait till next year when the books will be available on my website, although they will be a bit higher priced. Um, so if you want a discount, check out the Kickstarter now. Another fun project that I've been part of recently is a film project for Wilderness Scotland. Yeah, that's great. 
And so this videographer, Rupert Shanks, visited my studio and we went to some local spots to paint and draw. And basically he's just kind of telling an abbreviated version of my story and how it relates to where I live and protecting the beautiful wild places in Scotland. So I'm one of a handful of people that were filmed and you should definitely go check out Rupert's website and his socials because he's an amazing videographer. As most of you know, I've kind of been participating in Inktober this year using a modified prompt list and doing mostly landscape stuff, but I haven't kept up with it very well. However, I did take this opportunity to do my Patreon postcards for October using an ink wash technique. So it's like a tiny version of the painting process I showed you, which I'll link here and in the description maybe, um, just the big ink wash painting I did at the beginning of Inktober and so much fun. However, like crazy messy. <laughs> So at the end of 2021, I will be retiring my postcard tier on Patreon. I've been making these postcards for over four years, every single month, sending dozens of them all over the world. And it's been amazing, but also I've realized more recently especially that the time I spend making them and packing and sending them, which of course it's worth it, but the time I spend doing that is time that I want to be devoting to other parts of my business. I've been making so many changes this year and I am the kind of person that I feel like I should be able to do it all. But this year has been a hard lesson for me. As I mentioned earlier, like, on the ver being on the verge of burnout is not fun, let alone just purely, you know, crashing and burning out. But this year I've been focusing a lot on building up the foundation of my business, making more sources of passive income so that I actually have more time to create art. Because this year really showed me that I don't paint or draw as much as I want to. I do make a lot of content for the internet, but I don't have a lot of time to paint for myself, to work on my personal art. <laughs> um, and yeah, it's just, it's been a, a really sad realization. So I'm taking baby steps to adjust my business strategy and just hopefully make it work better for me. I'm so grateful for my patrons who support me on this journey. I mean, honestly, no matter what tier someone pledges in, that support is what allows me to do this full time. And I'm always trying to think of ways to make it fun for the people who support me and to keep putting out high quality content. Uh, but I really can't neglect my long-term goals, which is to be a better artist, which requires a lot of brush mileage. And I'm not giving myself enough time to grow my skills. <laughs> it's one thing to talk about how to do art and, you know, make videos and put out this kind of content, but it's another thing to actually sit down, give yourself hours and hours and days and weeks and months to put the time in to grow those skills to the next level. So yeah, that's where my head is at right now. And I'm hoping the changes I make on Patreon and elsewhere in my business will help me get there. I am replacing the postcard tier with a print tier, um, which I hope will actually be better for more people. Like it'll be a more affordable tier and more people will be able to participate and it won't be like always sold out. <laughs> um, or at least I don't think so. Uh, so yeah, I'm hoping that will kind of be the, uh, a, a good compromise and that people will still be excited about that. I'm very excited to show you this new toy that I got. Well, it's much more than a toy. It's a very important business tool. 
I'm always looking for ways to improve my videos, and one thing that always bothered me was how shaky some of my footage is. So I'm making baby steps and learning how to improve along the way. Right now we are walking in late or early afternoon. The sun is still out, but right here in the forest it's a little bit darker. Uh, I'm using my new DJI Pocket 2, I think it's called. So hopefully from now on, whenever I'm walking and just like getting around my in my videos it won't be as shaky. And I'm also teaching Wolfie how to use my video cameras and it's been a lot of fun, although he is really hard on himself. So I have to keep reminding him that it takes time to learn a new skill. You saw some of the footage in my recent video about the Etcher Slate Mini, which I did a little review about. But I think I'm also going to make a longer walk through the forest video for my other YouTube channel, just as like a relaxing forest walk. <laughs> it was just so beautiful that day and I have a lot of footage that I want to share. <laughs> Thank you for watching this long studio vlog and listening to <laughs> the latest that's been going on. I hope you're all doing well. I'll see you again soon. Take care. Mm -hmm.